fabulous. Yes! It looks so good. It's me, I'm Alexa. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. Today we have a brand new episode of Cottage Living, and there has been a lot of updates since the last episode. So, last episode, we all know that Kelly has proposed to Ophelia, and they should be getting married in today's episode, which I'm super excited for them. But before the wedding, we got some live updates for them. So, if you didn't know, I I do stream on Twitch and I streamed making over the Sims. So if you were at the stream, let me know in the comments because y'all already know what Callie and Ophelia look like because, well, you were there. Uh, so I gave them both a makeover because I feel like that's what they deserve for sure. And I think they turned out really cute and I can't wait for you all to see their wedding dresses as well. And also, if you can't tell already, they have have a house granted it's not fully furnished but it's a starting point so i did play this family by myself off camera so we can like get some more money and get things going because i felt like they were stuck in a tent for so long so i decided to play a bit on my own and grinded some money for them so they can finally own a cottage and they were able to actually get some more barn animals as well so we got a chicken coop and then i definitely want to get a uh, cow this time instead of another llama and then I organized their backyard where their plants are and they actually have a proper kitchen which is exciting and they have a proper bed which is also exciting and a proper bathroom granted it is still very empty but it is better than nothing <laughs> but I do want them to have a wedding we are going to plan the event for them on Sunday oh we don't have enough money so let's just sell some of her stuff that hasn't sold yet because there's a couple of cross stitch hoops that haven't sold so i definitely want to sell some of these and that should be good oh but we also need to buy a chicken we also need to buy a animal we're not ready our cow plant aged up and I'm trying to be very careful with it because uh, while I was playing off camera, they were eaten by the cow plant. So I'm trying to be uh, very careful so they don't die by it. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's go ahead and take a selfie with this crop. This is so cute. I love this so much. This is the cutest thing. And I definitely want to do that. Yes. And then how are our plants doing? I think we can evolve some of these now, right? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Oh, yes. We can evolve another one over here. And then I think we can evolve that one. And yeah, perfect. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy to finally be getting somewhere with this Let's Play because I felt like we were going to live in a tent forever and I definitely did not want that to happen. But it is Friday. They don't really have much to do. So let's actually check out the uh, wedding venue. <gasps> All right. This is the wedding venue. This is the park, but I replaced it with a gallery build and it is of a wedding. And I think this is so perfect. This is cool gorgeous wow holy moly this is beautiful i cannot wait for them to get married here oh this is beautiful look okay let's have them both talk about this talk about like oh yes this is where we're gonna get married and i can't wait our wedding's in a few days also, we do need to tell Ophelia about the inheritance that we were supposed to get. I feel like Ophelia would not mind that she got this call and haven't been told about it yet. But for now, let's just like look around and scavenge as well. Because for this, we need to forage five items from the bramble wood. So locate a harvestable hidden in the woods and collect it. Okay, where would that be? <gasps> the trees? holy moly these trees are so pretty in the fall time wow is this a collectible oh no that's a fox <laughs> my bed oh we actually haven't gone to sophie in a long time so let's have uh, ophelia actually do this this time because she hasn't been able to do that and then while ophelia does that we'll have callie 
look around to see if there's any collectibles we can get we can swim here that would be cool i think that would be really really cute and romantic and have them like just hang out here oh and then ophelia can definitely fish over here as well but like i can't find any collectibles it's hard wow look at the swans this is so beautiful like holy moly is she actually able to look for frogs here oh she can Oh, girl, not in those shoes, though. Kelly, hey, we're gonna look for frogs. Change your outfit. Here we go. That's much better. You can play in water in here. That's cute. Oh, that's cute. Oh, this poor kid getting attacked by bats. That's tough. All right, but how is she doing? Is she looking through here? Hopefully you can find something good. Look at all the pretty butterflies too. <gasps> wow. Oh, she found something. Oh, nice. We got avocado. Okay, since we got an avocado, let's go hide something here. I'll hide some lovely mushrooms. I feel like hiding mushrooms aren't bad. I mean, the last time we were here, we found trash fruit. So I feel like mushrooms are way better than trash fruit. <laughs> Now that they did that, let's have them sit over here and like talk because Callie wants to tell Ophelia about like what happened, but I think the inheritance fell through. But she still wants to tell Ophelia about it because this inheritance thing is a lot of money and she feels like even though she didn't receive it, she still wants to inform Ophelia about it. And that her proposing did not change anything because Callie always wanted to propose to her, but this was just a perfect opportunity for them. So let's go sit here together and tell her ophelia you know that our wedding is on sunday and well i have something to tell you about this whole thing i finally decided to propose because i did get a call from a really distant relative and they said they would give me inheritance if i got married yeah there she goes she's talking about like the death of the person that just recently died and that she was gonna get inheritance and she's explaining to ophelia that i proposed because well i i've been wanting to i've been wanting to propose to you for such a long time because i love you so much but i finally did it because the inheritance actually pushed me to do it so we can actually get some more money and i i didn't propose to you for the money but I thought it was a perfect opportunity to do it. So it was like a two birds with one stone kind of thing. And Ophelia is like, oh, Callie, I totally understand. I know you would never just marry me for just the money. I love you as well. Oh, no, not her needing to pee. Hold on, let's fix that a little. Because <laughs> you're having a very important conversation right now. Ophelia is telling Callie, like, I, I know that you wouldn't marry me just for the money. And I would have said yes either way if, if I knew about this honestly whether we get married or not i wouldn't be with anyone else but you you could have proposed to me in like 30 years and i would have still said yes or if you didn't propose to me at all i would have been fine because i just know i want to spend the rest of my life with you so inheritance or not callie i don't care i i just want to be with you and that's all that matters and then Callie just feels relieved because unfortunately with the inheritance, it did fall through. So she was afraid that Ophelia was going to get mad at her because she was promised this money and she wanted to provide more for both of them. But it was just Callie overthinking things. Ophelia wouldn't get mad at her for that. And like Ophelia has told Callie time and time again, I love you, Callie, no matter what, I will be with you through thick and thin. No no matter what i don't care about the money as long as you're happy as long as we're happy that's all that matters and even if the inheritance did fall through that's okay i'm still getting married to the love of my life and that's all i've ever needed is just you and me being together forever and then kelly's like oh this is why i love you and this is why i propose to you and finally propose to you because you're so understanding yeah look at that and then ophelia's like okay kelly i'm getting hungry though so 
can we head back home? And she's like, of course. Let's go home, hon. We got a big weekend. <laughs> Aw, these two are so cute. All right, lovebirds, let's go back home. Ophelia said she's hungry. I'm glad they talked it out and Callie told her about the inheritance. Even if it did fall through, they're still happy to be getting married, money or not. In her head, even if they're not getting the inheritance, I feel like they're happier getting all the hard earned money that they did because they were able to build a house without the inheritance. So this gives Callie security knowing that they can do this. Okay, so Ophelia's up. We got some stuff that we can sell. So let's sell all of this and that will help with the um, wedding that they have to pay for. And then Callie, let's wake you up as well. Today is a fair. I think it's the cow fair, right? Yeah, we don't have a cow, so we can't enter. But I do want to buy a cow and chicken. And after Ophelia sells all of this, I think we are going to do that. Let's see what Callie Callie wants to do. She wants to talk to her and make out with Ophelia. And then she just wants to talk to Ophelia as well. Oh, they're so cute. Yes, we're getting more money. Here you go. Uh, after you go eat, Callie will take care of your garden as well. And then Ophelia can resume cross stitching. Oh, yay! Speaking of cross stitching, though, she did get a sale for 722. Let's go! That's what we love to see. Oh my gosh. And with that, we can plan the wedding. So sell that. Yes! I love that. And then add the wedding. Where is it? Here we go. Wedding. And then invite the whole town. So we'll invite Michael, Lavina, Raul, Agatha, Kim. Cecilia, Derek, Simon, Thomas, Rami for sure, and Sarah. I do kind of want to invite Agnes, but I feel like I might regret it. But that's like Agatha's cousin. So, you know, I will do it. I know I was worried not to do it, but I'm going to do it. <laughs> and then we'll just hire a caterer, hire a mixologist, and then hire a musician. And then we're going to have the wedding at the Isle of Volpe wedding. And then we'll have the wedding at, I feel like 11 a.m. would be a good time. It's thunderstorming on Sunday. Oh, no, no, no. We're going to fix that. That is not going to ruin our wedding. Okay, but perfect. We got it. Yes. So let's have you keep cross-stitching. Let's go make some more while Callie take care of Silk. How's Silk doing? Silk is actually good. Let's purchase an animal and let's buy a spotted cow and let's purchase some chickens. I kind of want to get the little tiny chicks, but I guess we'll just start with the basics. So what's... Uh, they're all the same price. I guess we'll get a brown rooster and a brown hen yes finally so exciting <laughs> we got new animals after a long hecking time here kelly are you coming over yes look it you have a new friend silk if y'all have any name suggestions for the cow and also the chickens definitely definitely let me know Oh, and now that we have chickens, we do have the rainbow sweater vest thing that we got a long time ago. So that's exciting. Oh, this is so cute. <gasps> yeah. Oh my God. Look at you. You look fabulous. Yes. It looks so good. I love that. Oh, they're finally like getting their lives together. And it makes me so excited. Oh, let's milk the cow. So we can have our groceries as well because we do need to get like ingredients in order to, uh, you know, make actual food and stuff. You're so cute. I'm so happy about this. I'm like so excited. Hey, are you kidding me? Why are you knocking over? Wow, I see how it is. But we do need to craft some animal treats as well. Can we do that? Yes. So let's go make these. And then how's she doing? We should get a chair outside so she can like see Callie work. Oh, but we do have avocados. So I do want to plant these. Yeah, let's go plant these and help Callie out over here. 
Oh, they're both so tired, so they're gonna take a nap together. How cute. I mean, they are hardworking farmer girls, so as they should, they deserve this. They finally get a nice bed, so they deserve all the comfy stuff. After like a long time struggling, they so deserve this. Yay! Oh my god, Crumple Bottom One would like to purchase a cross to troop. You think it's Agatha or Agnes? That'd be really cool if it was. So I want to keep this fox one. So let's have her finish that. And then we can give that as like a wedding present to Callie. I think that would be really, really cute. Yeah. So what Callie doesn't know is that Ophelia is working on this cross stitch for her as their wedding present. Yes. Okay, so we're gonna keep that and then let's resume that one because that one is for her plopsy shop. And then this one, let's create a wall mountain copy so we can give that and use that to decorate our house. Ooh, can we collect eggs already too? What the heck? So the fair has started. But, I mean, we should go into town and talk to everyone because their wedding's tomorrow, so might as well hit up everyone and talk to them and get excited. Okay, so we are here. Here is the cow fair, which is so exciting. I can't wait to see everyone's entry. But, let's go say hi. Let's go. Can we sell? We, can we actually sell some items? that we got hi agatha it's good to see you oh yeah okay let's sell our llama wool like holy crap we have so much of it 800 sheesh that's a lot and let's sell some bluebells and our blueberries wow holy moly some lovely mushrooms oh <gasps> holy yes, moly we're rich thank you agatha how are you we appreciate your business here your simones have a nice day thank you let's go have a hand for it heart to heart it's been a while i hope you're coming to our wedding tomorrow we're really really excited but it's good to see you okay let's see if she would haggle with us i don't know if she would but all right i think this milk has chunks in it ew no way it's going to win ew what Wait, that's so cool though. Wait, that's your own chocolate milk? That's cool. Oh, nice. She's gonna give us a discount because she knows it's our wedding tomorrow. So thank you. I'm gonna judge other people's entries. Like, let's be judgmental. And of course, look, Ophelia's at the freaking bar talking to her friend Sarah. She loves chatting away with these people. Like, hey, how's it going, Sarah? I feel like it's been forever. Our wedding's tomorrow. We hope you're gonna come. We would love for you to uh, head to our wedding tomorrow so yeah so like ophelia's over here just talking to everyone of course because she just loves talking to uh, people and then uh, callie is just here just judging everything which i love oh hi lavina lavina i hope you're gonna come to our wedding tomorrow as well why does this milk look so watery it is milk isn't it ew <laughs> Callie finally feels comfortable enough to uh, talk to the locals because she's been living here for a while and everyone's been nice to her. So she's just gonna vibe with them and hang out. Yeah, let's join the dance. Oh, and Michael's here. We should talk to him too. Yeah, let's vibe. Get ready. Tomorrow's the big day. I'm so excited for her. Oh, Rami. Hey, is she leaving again? Every time Rami's here, she like leaves. Sad. <laughs> so sad. But is she ordering something? Oh, she's grabbing chips. Okay. Love that for her. Would love to stick around longer, but we have to get ready for tomorrow because tomorrow's the big day. But good luck to the people who entered. The milks look interesting. So good luck. All right, bye-bye. We'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. That's the plan. You better come to our wedding tomorrow. Okay, our wedding starts really soon. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah, it's happening. Are you excited, Kelly? Can you believe it? <laughs> She's like talking to her chickens and being like, I'm gonna get married soon. Are you excited? Ophelia's just like watching this happen and she's like, ah, oh, that's my future wife to be. I love her. <laughs> Look how happy she looks too. She's like, yeah, I love you. I'm so excited to get married. Okay, the wedding's about to begin. Let's go. What are these dresses? These uh, wedding dresses are awful. Change. 
change into the outfit I gave you and worked so hard on. Okay, here we go. Let's change. Yes! Okay, look at them. They're both so beautiful. I'm gonna cry. And our friends are here, which is so exciting. All right. So let's go thank everyone for coming. <gasps> Wait, ask to feel baby? Oh my god, she's pregnant. Congratulations. Welcome in, everyone. Thank you, everyone, for coming. I'm so excited. Y'all look fan freaking tastic. Is Rami here? Yeah, Rami is here. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Y'all, are you ready? Everyone better sit down, okay? Sit down because we're gonna get married. So it's time. Let's go get married to Ophelia. Yay, and Cecilia made it as well. Let's make sure this wedding is beautiful. All right, everyone, sit down. All right, oh my god, okay, 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 okay. Agnes, don't you dare, okay. She's gonna cross stitch, okay, perfect. Look at these two. Oh my god, I'm so happy for them. It's finally time. It's what they deserve after being together for years and like them struggling to live in Hanford on Bagley and now they finally have a house. So it's finally time for them to officially get married. Tie the knot. Is everyone sitting? Hold on, let's check if everyone's sitting. Okay, almost everyone. You know what? Good enough. Look at Agatha and Agnes chilling out with each other. Love that. Okay, okay. Let's watch this beautiful ceremony, everyone. Oh my gosh, look at them. And I love the piano in the background. Very romantic. Yes! Oh my god, that, that ring is huge. Girl, damn. Congratulations! They're officially married! Yay! Oh my god, look at these beautiful brides! Agnes? Agnes, are you kidding me? She's like laughing. She's like, Agnes, you're really doing this right now. I'll, I'll smack. <laughs> and she's like, hey. Hey, Agnes. <laughs> <laughs> hey Thomas. They're all like, congratulations on the wedding. Oh, she got a sentiment. What happened? What happened? Bitter after scolding. You find Agnes very attractive. Kelly, what is this? Anyway, Kelly's so bitter about the scolding she got from Agnes Crumple Bottom. You know what? We only invited you because you're cousins with Agatha, okay? And you're part of the communities. We had to. But yay! Let's go thank everyone for coming. Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming. And then let's have Ophelia thank everyone else for coming. We really appreciate it. Thank you for welcoming me and Callie to the community. We actually feel like family now. And I'm so grateful that y'all joined and it came to our wedding because you guys are our family. And I'm really, really happy that we got to invite all of you here. Look at these two. She's like, oh, Agnes. Please, for once, just be kind. This is a beautiful wedding. Why did you have to do that? And she's like, Agatha, you know me. I had to. I had to. I don't care if they got married today. No one is spared from my purse. <laughs> do we? Do we get a cake? Did someone bake a cake? Oh, no. I don't think we get cake because there's no kitchen here. You know what? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Here. Resume my cake. They didn't finish cooking this. What the? I guess we have to do it. Because our caterer is over here talking to our guest. Wow. What was the point? What was the point? I really want them. Okay, you know what? Let's drink. Let's order a drink. Let's have some fun. Make sure your special day is memorable and special. And you two remember today because you both really deserve it. I'm both so happy for them. And I'm so happy that they're finally married and finally making their way to the top. And I am so excited because they're, they're almost ready to have kids now. And I'm going to cry. Like, I'm seriously really excited. <laughs> okay, beautiful. All right, before it gets dark though, I do want them to go over here together and have their first dance. Put Ophelia's ring on? What? Wait, I want to see that. What is that? Where does that come from? Why that's so cute! Oh, what? What 
is that interaction from? Is that from Slice of Life? Let's do super romantic compliment. Oh my god, y'all. Y'all are both really drunk, huh? Oh, Callie! What was that? Oh, that's so cute! Excited about getting married? Celebrate marriage? Yes, let's go tell her how excited and happy we are about us getting married. Look at who's looking super beautiful today. I can't keep my eyes off of you! Stop! Stop it right now. They're so cute. All right, let's do this and then where is slow dancing? Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Agnes is playing with butterflies, so hopefully she doesn't hit y'all with the purse again. But look at these two. They're so pretty. They're so beautiful. They're so cute. And I'm so happy that they finally got married. Yes, look at them. I'm gonna cry. Oh no, she's a little dazed, but that's okay. Let, let's not mind that. Let's not mind them being a little buzzed. Having their first dance together as a married couple, and they're like really happy to be doing this, and they definitely made the right choice of moving all the way here, even if they said, Hey, you're ruining our romantic moment. <laughs> leave go away oh my god okay thank you no oh my god he's just gonna watch okay let's just pretend he's not there but anyway if you did enjoy this sweet episode of cottage living let me know in the comments below and by giving this video a thumbs up also if you have cow names or chicken names definitely let me know in the comments as well i would really really appreciate them and if you didn't know i stream on twitch over twitch.tv slash melixa i would love to see my boba buddies over there but thank you everyone for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye everyone